What's up you guys, Christian here in this bigger, leaner, stronger workout day two workout video narration commentary, whatever you want to call it. This is again from bigger, leaner, stronger. I have gone over in a couple different videos, his workout, the overview of it, the sets, reps, etc. I will leave those videos in the description below. This is my week two day two of the bigger leaner stronger back day workout so this this is essentially a pull day the workout i will put on the screen but it is essentially doing deadlifts some sort of row in this case the barbell row and some weighted chin-ups and it's a pretty straightforward program three exercises three sets each four to six reps using 85 percent of your one rep max here you can just see me warming up before my big uh, deadlift sets. Now I haven't deadlifted prior to like before about a month ago. I hadn't deadlifted in a year, and that's because my stupid gym at my local gym does not have like round plates for deadlifting. They have the octagon weird stupid plates that roll around everywhere. You can't drop them so. I decided to uh, pick some up myself with a barbell and so now I have these new ethos bumper plates which you can see they're super nice and I've been putting them to work for the past couple of weeks and now I can drop my weights without worrying about breaking them like my old plates the ones behind me on the ground right there they they were cheap ones from sports authorities they worked but you can't drop them and I dropped them last week while doing heavy deadlifts and they actually cracked now that I have these ethos plates, I'm really happy that I can do deadlifts and not worry about any cracking or anything like that. And so now I'm doing my last warm-up set before the main working sets. Just one rep with uh, close to 90% of my actual working set weight. And so my first set here of deadlifts is pretty... I think my form is getting better, but I have to do a better job of not jerking it off of the ground if that makes sense so i'm jerking it off the ground like super explosive but that's making my arms and my back round a little bit which i'm trying to fix so as you can see here on my first uh my first set you'll see my arms like really jolt you'll see right right there it kind of like jolts so my arms like pull first before my back and legs do if that makes sense which causes my back to round a little bit so i need to fix that but i'm working on it talking to a couple of people to see how i can fix it it's just a little fix that i can make next time but i just noticed it after watching my recording that i do jerk it off of the ground too much and yeah but uh deadlifts anyways three sets four to six reps this is using 365 pounds for all three sets so the first set i get six reps I believe the next set I get five reps, but so using chalk there with the reverse grip helps a lot, especially with those heavy weights. But um, this next scene I, I'm gonna let this part play because in because Creed Two is coming out this Thanksgiving, which is in a couple of days. I decided to play the soundtrack from the first Creed, which is a mix of like the Rocky soundtrack with the hip-hop kind of rapping song from meek mill so i want you guys to listen to this song it's freaking sick
So yes, I do need to work on my form, I know, but wasn't that song pretty damn sick? I, I like it a lot. It's from the first Creed. Um, it's the Meek Mill soundtrack with the Creed soundtrack. Like It's from his training montage in the Creed movie, so yeah. Um, but anyways, back to the training. This is the second exercise, the barbell rows. This is my warm-up set. I'm trying to remember how I, the video I watched on the barbell row taught me, but I was kind of struggling, so <laughs> this isn't really the right form. On my next, in the next scene, you'll see that I'm actually doing it right. But if you ever do the barbell rows, whether it be underhand like I'm doing or overhand, there's a great video by Alan Thrall. He actually shows you a really good, simple tutorial on how to do the barbell row correctly, which I was not doing just now. But this is pretty much what I, how to do the barbell row right here. You, it's almost like a deadlift setup, but this is kind of like a pen leg slash barbell row you want to have a straight back and you want to use as much of your back as possible in this to lift the weight up explosively and this allows you to use a little bit more weight i believe it's not as heavy as or as hard as like keeping the weight off the ground at all times and putting strain on your lower back this is a lot safer i think in my opinion and a lot more fun i don't know i, I feel my back a lot more doing it this way but yeah, I'm doing 165 here. So on the ground, once you're ready, you straighten the back like that and then pull it up. Touch your chest or wherever in the middle of your back between the belly button and your lower chest. And here's a better angle of it. It's almost like a Romanian deadlift setup. If you've ever done Romanian deadlifts, you put your back straight and lift it up all the way straight. So yeah, while this is playing, the Bigger, Leaner, Stronger program is very, has a very, very big emphasis on heavy lifting. As you can see, none of this is like, there's no lightweight stuff here. It's all pretty heavy, all using 85% of your one rep max, which I like. It lets you go super hard, super intense, and I like it. And this, the, you can't hear it, but obviously I was playing very loud music. It's very intense. You're going all out on all of these sets and reps. And so the last one was weighted chin-ups. I'm only showing one set here, but I did three sets. Again, four to six reps. My biceps aren't very strong. I'm trying to work on that too. Um, but now that I'm bulking, I hope to get these numbers up. But um, anyways, that's a quick video, you guys. Just wanted to show my progress, my training progress on this lean bulk that I'm doing. If you have any questions on the Bigger, Leaner, Stronger program, I have been following it for quite some time. So let me know in the comments below. And I will definitely leave you guys a response. See you guys on the next one.